Alright, how's it going guys? I'm back again with another video. Today I have a video of this belt sander. It's a Cornwell. I bought this about a month ago and I really like it. It works great. Um, I like it better than... I have a short Mac one here. I think this is a 13 inch by 3 8. This is the first one I bought. And I wish I didn't buy it. It was way overpriced. I got it off the Mack truck. It was like 300 bucks, And I had to have it at the time. Just uh, the job I was doing at the moment, I needed it. So the bad thing about the Mack is the short one, the Mini, is these um, belts you'll get about two welds grinding on them and the belts done I mean if you're buying the belts you will not want this short one it just goes through them too quick um, the longer one this I think this is an 18 inch by half inch you can do a whole bedside and taking it off and you you can use one belt I mean, I really recommend the longer one. The only good thing about this shorter one, there's like some spots you can't get into if you really need to get into to a tight spot. This one gets in really well. And this is adjustable. This uh, Allen right there, you loosen that up and this can adjust any way you want. On the Cornwell, it has this lever right here, and I absolutely love that. I mean, you could put it whatever way you want and just tighten it back down, and you could reach in there. And I mean, for some tighter spots, this won't work, but since I've had this, I absolutely love it. It has a um, regulator, air regulator. Right on the back, you can slow it down or speed it up. But no complaints. This was, I think, 130 bucks on sale on Cornwell. I recommend it. I mean, you can't get online and order one for that. Much cheaper anyway. But I would definitely go with the Cornwell. It's... It's real useful. The thing about these belt sanders over a grinder, you don't have to worry about sparks. These don't throw off that much sparks. I mean, you can really get technical and with the pressure and everything, whatever you're grinding, I recommend these. I'm, once I got one, bought one, uh, I won't go back. Not for spot welds anyway. And this one, I can't. You're just changing belts all the time. This Mac Mini, I mean, you're. That's like paper. You use them once and just throw it away. You can burn this one up in like a minute on it, just two or three welds, and it's done. And you have to have the Allen to adjust it that's another thing i don't like about it i think this one's fairly new this cornwell yeah it's a half inch by 18 inch belt it takes nice about the half inch is it's the size of a spot weld about so one swipe you can get it this 3 8 you're gonna be digging around a little bit more to to grind out the spot welds but you don't have to worry, really worry about glass when you're doing the metal. If there's a window close or you're doing a quarter or anything, I highly, highly recommend this. Um, guys, if you have any questions about any of these tools or anything I didn't explain, feel free to hit me up, email me, or comment below. Um, hit the like buttons if you like the videos. And I'll try to do some videos where I'm actually using the thing. 
I have a few projects that I can do and just show you a little more in depth how well these work but I recommend them so um, yep if you have any questions just hit me up I'll get back to you and thanks again subscribe and I'll see you in the next video thanks bye